Hey guys, this is Kate and I am super excited to be the guest designer for Click Kits for the month of May. So I have um, already received my May kit. I'm actually filming this in March because I um, received it today and I really want to get started playing with it so I need to show it to y'all before I dig in. So I got a really sweet um, card from the girls at Click Kits. I thought it was so cute. Look how cute that is. Super, super cute. So um, that was really sweet. And let me go ahead and show, well, I'll show you the extras that I got. Um, I come in this cute little glassine bag. And a couple of them are um, going to be a new, new release in May. And then a couple of them you might have already seen in the shop. So. Um, the first one is this set of pineapple flare and it is so adorable. And I think this is, will, will be older when this video is published. And I'm not sure if it will still be available, but I'm just going to go ahead and include it just in case. Um, this is a little set of stickers from Kessie Art, which is like a French company. And they're really cute. Again, these are already in the shop, so they may not be available um, when this video posts. But I hope they will. And then these are super, super cute. And of course, Easter will have already passed and been a, a month a month ago when this goes up, but they're still super cute and you could probably use them for other times of the year, especially if you like bunnies because look how cute these little acrylic bunnies are. Oh my gosh, I can't even stand it. And they're in these super cute colors. Let me see, I don't know if you can see that, but they're really cute. So just three little, and they're super lightweight and they're not, um, they're not, real dimensional. But I thought those would be so fun in like Project Life or on a um, card or something. They're just adorable. And then this is what I'm so excited about. This is from Hero Arts. It's called Pineapple. And it is the cutest pineapple. And I know that pineapples are like the new Chevron or something, but I am totally okay with that because I love pineapples. I actually, one of my very first stamps when I was, I start, I got my first stamps when I was like probably seven years old. And one of my very first stamps was a pineapple. It wasn't as cool looking as this one, but it was a pineapple. So I also had a watermelon. Anyhow, let me get into the kit. So this is how your kit will come to you in this really cute little bag with a quick kit sticker. And it is so full of fun stuff. I haven't looked at everything. I'm going to show the papers first and then I'll show you the embellishments. So the first paper is, from, well, I think they're all from Amy Tangerine Rise and Shine. This is called Mia, and it's these super cute, um, like letters with a heart on them, and it's in it's silver foil, which is really cool and different. Oh, and the back is really pretty, like watercolor with silver foil. foil. And I just want you to look at the branding strip. It's like silver foiled doilies. Oh my gosh, that would be so cute. Oh, I love that. This one's called Lucy, and they all have this kind of like watercolory feel to them, but they're very like Amy Tangerine. And then that's the other side. This one's called Riley. You could totally cut those out. Those would be super cute to cut out. Ooh, that's fun. It's called Samantha. Very classic Amy Tan. I love that side. Emma, I think these are four by four squares, but like I don't, I don't do, I don't have any four by four like page protectors. So what I would do is, since these are four inches, I would just measure like three inches over and turn it into a four by three card or three by four card that you can use in if you do Project Life in like a traditional Project Life um, page protector or like this Good Times one. I would just center it, so I would just cut like half an inch from each side of and then I would have a three by four, which would be a lot of fun. And you do the same thing with this picture, this one. So they're really versatile, even if you don't have um, four by four page protectors. Oh, that's so cute, it says bright idea. Pretty great. That's not like a a lighting thing. That is actually like a orb in the middle of it, like a light, but it's really pretty. Um, I just met myself. Okay, this one is called Stella, and it's this kind of paisley doodled, it's not really, well, I guess it is kind of watercolory, of like oranges and pinks. And then this side is a 
polka dot. Oh, this is probably my favorite. This is called Ella. If you watched my, um, one of my, my March haul video, I showed this paper and I love this paper. It's like a yellow um, watercolor with a white heart on it. Love it. Gray on gray diagonal. This one is called Emery. And this has uh, four by six and three by four cards on it. So perfect for anything really, any kind of project life you're doing. I know there's like so many different project life options nowadays, but most of them fit four by six or three by four. And this has this kind of burnt orangey color. And then these two papers are so cool. This one's called um, Kirsten, I think is how you pronounce it. And it's craft paper, but it has black on it. And it's so cute. It says like, I love right now. Hey, hey, this is awesome. Remember this. Let's stay home. I'm not really sure. I don't know how I would use this paper, but I love this paper. Um, I don't know. I, it would be kind of hard to cut apart. I guess you could cut like some of the little thingies out. I don't know. I think you could probably use watercolor on this, like the ones from Michaels that are really opaque and like color parts of it in give it some color and use it as a background. I don't know, I'll have to play with it and see. But the other side is this really cute um, polka dot, which I really like. This one is called Monroe, and it is uh, some four by six cards, some three by four cards, four by four cards, I think. Yeah, four by four. And then some, maybe two by two. And then some other kind. You could definitely, and this is this is you can use in a million different ways. I put this side super cute too with the triangle. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pieces of paper. And I would say that three of them are like specialty papers because the the two craft papers and the the foil paper are pretty like sort of specialty papers. I would say in in my opinion. Okay, so that is all paper. So no cardstock, just um, pattern papers, which I love because I only use white cardstock anyhow, um, normally. Then you get this really cool set of thickers called Everyday. I really like this font and I love that they are craft because you can do so many things with them. You can use, like I love to use a, a white pigment ink pad on them to give them kind of a um, weathered look. Oh, look how cute, it has little hearts ampersand, bunch of numbers, plus and minus signs, um, asterisks, hashtags, parentheses, pretty much everything you need in a pack of thickers. So I love that they're craft because they go, you can just use them as craft or you can change them. And it, this is really cool. I have never seen this before. I didn't even know, sorry for the crinkling, that Jelly Bean Soup made paint, but you get a whole bottle and it's big, it's two ounces. It's called Happy Hues yummy yellow and it's like a bright yellow acrylic paint oh, which I'm imagining is perfect to use on these thickers oh you could do like a you could water this down a little bit and maybe even mix some white with it and do like a wash over that craft paper that would be really cool looking I can't get this open but Anyhow, it's a really pretty yellow and it's a big old bottle of paint. So that is really cool that you get like kind of a mixed media type thing that you can, I mean, this will last away after you're done, you know, working with the kit. Um, love these. Some, they're called Remarks Epoxy Stickers. There's 21 pieces. They're really, really cute. So you have the one, two, three, the heart, and then these have like kind of a gold I don't know how they made it gold because it's like epoxy, but they're really, really cool. And I really hope that this is showing up well with my creative lighting thing going on here. And then you get this little baggie of stuff and I don't know what's in here and I'm very excited to find out. Let me zoom in a little bit. Maybe that will help. So oh, I'm definitely keeping that yellow washi tape. That's really cute. So, oh, look at these flare. So cool. So they definitely match like the colors of the kit. They say bright ideas, wide awake, be happy, and then just like a patterned one. And then these are some pieces of, these are actually washi tape. 
and they like they're cut into strips already. Let me just pull one up. So each like pattern is a strip. That's so that's really cool. And you get the two different ones. Because I think they come like three of each sheet in a pack. So this is perfect that you get like one of each without having a whole ton of them. And then some really fun craft doilies. Like three different types or designs. Those are fun since there's all that craft paper. And then I think these are printables. These may be printables like that you can print out. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to check on that. If they come in the kits like this or if you print them out yourself like this. Uh, I'm not positive. But this one says a picture worth a thousand words. That's really cute. And then a frame on the back. This one says completely happy and like a watercolor effect. This one is really pretty. It says you mean the world to me. Like a watercolored world. I love that. Um, just smile and let it all go. Oh, that's fun. Oh, I like both sides of that. This one says soar and this cool pattern. So I'm going to have to, I'll put like a, um, the information below whether these actually come like this in a package to you or if they're printables and they just sent them to me already printed you know to to work with um and then there are cut files and here are what the what they look like already cut so this is super fun look at that isn't that awesome it's like a 12 by 12 of all these circles and you could totally, you could probably do it on your silhouette, but if you cut out the whole thing, you could cut these circles out individually or, you know, and just use like one or two of them to do like masking or something. Or you could, you know, put this whole thing down. You could watercolor this first and then put it down on a background paper. There's just so many things you can do with these big cut files like this. They're so cool. I'm gonna keep it on this white paper just so that it doesn't get messed up. And then there's, Seems to be a bunch of smaller ones. There's these kind of like wonky frame, and then that's like the inside for it. This one says Shutterfly, and this one says Photo Bomb, but I have them already. Hang on, let me show them to you this way. It'll be easier to see. this is what it looks like so this one says shutterfly can you see that i hope you can see that and then the frame and then this one says photo bomb it's really cute and then there are two tag or a ta there's a tag i guess you can do it in different shapes so it says the best um so super fun i am really really excited to work with this kit and to post some really fun videos for you guys so stay tuned to the channel to see how i use this kit and um, hopefully you'll go and check out Click Kits. Thanks so much and thank you to the girls at Click Kit for entrusting me with your May design work. I'll talk to you guys real soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.